Hi guys and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a 5M server in 2025 and this isn't just any old bog standard 5M server. This is a full integrated ready to go out of the box running OX inventory, OX door locks and everything else you're going to need. So stick with me. If you like what you see, hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button and I'm going to be bringing so much more content to this channel. It's going to be all about QB core and 5M servers. So stick with me and I'll show you the ins and outs, the best resources around and we'll see how we go from there. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do on your PC is get in set up. So first of all, what you wanna do is set up a GTA folder on your desktop. I always start it like this. I always add two folders called one server and one data from here what you want to do is you want to go to here and go to google and just simply type in gta server artifacts 5m server artifacts now it should bring you to this website I will link the this I will link the website down in the description. Uh, you could go with latest recommended. I always go for the latest. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Uh, open it up. You need to use your own version of uh, your unzipping program. For me, it's uh, Wimra. Uh, very very good one. Uh, make sure you make sure you pay for that. And then what we want to do is we just want to drag that into the server folder. So now we have that in our server folder. There's a few more steps we need to do uh, to get fully set up. And that is, you want to have MariaDB installed. So MariaDB. So from here, we're just gonna click download, server version, and download. Open the file, click next, accept the terms and conditions, next, next. Now we come to this part. I would suggest leaving modify password and just leaving that as unticking that one. I already have this installed, but you will click next, 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 and then click on continue, and then that will install that. You're also going to need HiID SQL, which is fairly simple. First one that comes up, download 64-bit installer. You'll download that, and then same sort of process. Click on next, and then accept and go for it. Again, I already have this installed. So now, how comes the fun parts? So we want to go into HiID SQL. Once you've done that, so we're going to delete that one off. So now we're going to create a whole new database for our server. And we're just going to click on it. Next off, we want to go back to this folder and we want to double click on the FX server. See, that's going to start the pre building of our GTA server now. So what we need to do is we need to go back to the CFX and make sure that this number is exactly the same as this number. In our case, it is for TX admin. It's now going to ask you to sign in. Uh, so, and then ask for a backup password. So this can be anything you want. For me, I'm just going to do my normal. Uh, make sure you click on this and then click register. Okay, so from here, if you've never set up a 5M server, this is how you do it. It's within TX admin. So from here, what we want to do is we want to go and type in our server name. So for me, it's just going to be test build. It can be anything you want. Here's where it gets good. For this, we're going to need a remote URL template. 
and I will link the remote URL template in the document in the description below. So, so from here, what you want to do is you want to click on remote URL template, and then the linked remote URL template linked below is the one you want to use. So that will be linked. So this is made by the Order of the Sacred Framework team. And I can honestly tell you that what these guys have done here is amazing. You have Ox Inventory, Ox Door Locks, and every single resource that is out of the box ready to go. You cannot ask for a better server. Your fuel setup, everything is there. And this is all free scripts. I must stress that. It's all free scripts. But if you are just starting out looking for a dev server on the QB Core framework, this is probably the best way of getting into 5M right now. So you just want to click on next. And then this is where I change my server path. So I want to get rid of that and then go back to here. And remember that folder that we made called data? That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to click that and paste that in there. Now that's now said, go to recipe deployer. So we're going to click that. I'm going to click on, just make sure that everything's right. I'm going to click on next. Now, here's the interesting part. It's going to ask you for your license key. Now, I have a license key. So I can do this. And now that is going to build my 5M server for me. And once that's completed, we will have an out of the box ready experience that is great for beginners on 5M. So now we can see that that is completed and all of our resources have downloaded and been placed into a grip folder. So simply all we need to do is click next on this one. Now this is gonna bring us to our server CFG file and we just wanna check that make sure everything's good in here and that all of the settings are grand. So as you can see, it's got a map manager, chats, all the basic stuff. And then where it gets interesting is down here. So we've got Oxlib installed already out of the box, QB core, Ox target, the Ox folder, which contains your Ox door locks and Ox inventory. Uh, you've got your QB, standard QB folder. You've got your standalone folder. This libs folder is where you would put all of your bridges uh, and they've already been set up in the, some of them have already been set up for you. Your add-on folder is where you're gonna put anything script related. You've got your voice folder and your assets folder, which is your cars and your clothing and map files. I normally just use this for map files. Uh, and then it obviously adds in your identifier for your admin as well. So we're going to save and run the server for the first time. As you can see, there's 107 resources already generated. And as you can see, as we look through down the list, what it actually comes with. First time you load up the server, it's going to run through a few things the yearn needs to be installed that's going to install now for you as you can see below uh, once that's done you'll get a uh, um, a notification to say chat has been in uh, chat has started once that's done we can reset the server restart the server one more time and that is it you have a fully working UB core server in 2025 so now as you can see started resource screenshot basic is completed we can restart the server again. Wait for this to reload back up. Once you see the CFXRE logo, you know it's good to go. Open up 5M. And we can connect to the server for the first time. So we're going to create our character. I don't know why, but my always my test build server character's name is Mike. Box. It's always that. It's always that. And I normally, just because of it's a test build, I always change it back to say 2000 March 26th. Create a character. You see that my inventory is loaded. 
uh, we're going to choose Integrity Way as our starting apartment. And as you can see, I'm now fully in. You already have a built-in clothing system. Everything's already on the target. And there you go, guys. This is your ready-built server in 2025 completed with hunting and there's all number of things i will go over in a video in the next video what resources are in this package um but right now that is exactly everything you need to do to build your qb core server in 2025 thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe See you in the next one.